concert, he dropped in for a look around. What were we thinking? <laughs> in honour of his visit, there were disco dancing displays. Renditions of some of his best known songs. And he even managed to find his own desk. Yeah, right here. <laughs> there was also a revealing question and answer session. Uh, we used to have uh, sugar, sugar sandwiches. Um, yeah, uh, bread and butter with sugar, or bread and butter and tomato ketchup. And, and that's what we used to bring to school. School time over, now for part two of the tour. Well, this is 51 Keppel Road. This is, um, this is the, the house we all lived in as a family, about 1956-57. Barry bought it back a decade ago and is now the landlord. A quick meeting with the property manager. Uh, how's the roof? Is the roof's good? okay. Yeah, it's yeah. a fair bit of pointing and the chimney starts to be just Okay, but you know, you've just got to let me know. Yeah. I... His sons and grandchildren wanted to see inside. All of the brothers and, and our sister, this is where we all slept. And there was a mantelpiece here. And there was, the double bed was there, and the whole objective was to dive up the mantelpiece and land on the bed. Down there, inside that cellar, I used to make... I used to make false guitars. I used to, uh, with pieces of wood. So for me, it was all about pretending to be a pop artist. All those hits that you've written, six US number ones in a row you wrote. You were on stage last night, you're playing the O2 on Thursday. Yeah, and this is where it all started. This is exactly where it started. This is the room where we first thought, well, Let's try singing together. I want to be a pop star. And Morris and Robin would say, well, oh, we want to be pop stars too, but they were like six years old. So was your first ever band formed in this room? Yeah, the Rattlesnake. Yeah. And then it was We Johnny Hayes and the Blue Cats. And that didn't work either. <laughs> <laughs> but now, 50 years later, he can't leave without even the neighbours asking for an autograph. 56 to Colin Patterson, BBC News, Manchester. Sugar sandwiches for school lunch. Sugar scans. I mean, you didn't have sugar, they had ketchup sandwiches. Sugar sandwiches. That's what my grandma used to give my mum's kids. And there you go, guys. Yeah, the BGs. Keppel Road. Woohoo! Where you are, not very good nutrition. Not very good.